one. Shit. Hello, friends, and today I'll be going over the Fulma M1 Modus, or Modus, however you'd like to pronounce it, it does not matter to us. This particular model is heavily modified. Why is it so modified? Because it belongs to me. Hey guys, welcome to Backroad Moto. Um, the first video ever on Backroad Moto, so congratulations, you're viewing it. <laughs> um, this is not a video so much for my helmet as it is for my helmet uh, cam setup. Um, a couple of really generous moto vloggers, Rev and Rav, and more bad ideas, pointed me in the right direction for the Sony Action Cam. That's the one I chose uh, due to price and functionality and everything I really needed. I got the waterproof job on there. Um, and I managed to get my microphone set up to where it will go in the bottom of the waterproof case for the Sony Action Cam without having to do uh, any intricate modifications. There's my camera mount or my microphone mount right there. That is definitely going to change, uh, but it's a modular helmet, so I'm having problems figuring out where to put my microphone. But that's all right. I'll figure that out. Um, let's see what else. Uh, this don't be a wussy and. Get it, get it done. Get that, sh that microphone hole up in there. Jam it in its fucking hole. Uh, I didn't use GoPro mounts. I ended up using Sony Action Cam mounts because I found a kit on uh, Amazon called the E-Kit that comes with two pieces that fit together perfectly. Um, as you can see, the, you know, the microphone mount is not going to work, I don't think. I haven't tried it out yet because I don't have uh, uh, SD cards in for the camera yet, or I would be giving you a moto vlog. But I'll definitely have to change that up. If you have any advice on how to get that rigged up, please leave it in the comments. I'll gladly take your advice. Uh, I really like this this ball and socket joint uh, mount that I found with the E kit on Amazon. Uh, because uh, for that reason, for what I just did, you could reach up there, loosen it up, put it in a different angle or whatever, and then tighten it back up. And if the app for the Sony Action Cam is working for you, um, then you can see what, what you're pointing at. You don't have to worry about if you're hitting your target or not. And that is the shit, man. This is pretty much, uh, I'm pretty much done. Of course, I haven't uh, taken it for any rides and checked it out, but it should be fine. And thanks for visiting Backroad Moto. We'll see you next time on the road, hopefully.